Hey everybody, it's Christopher here with 3DO Gaming, and today I have my Evercade Retro System here with me, and I've already in plugged in, bring that back up, the Atari Lynx Collection 2. This is the one of my new cartridges that just came in. I have already done an Atari Collection, Atari Lynx Collection 1, so that should already be up on my YouTube channel. I'll put a link in the description if you want to take a look at that. But I've went ahead and pre-loaded the Lynx 2 cartridge and this is the book that goes with it which i really like that they actually put real manuals in there even if it's just little tits bits of information it's just nice to it's nice to have it so this cartridge here has eight games included with it so it gives you a little history on the atari Lynx, and it's got california games which is an assortment of uh Four different uh, mini games, basically BMX, surfing, half pipe, or foot bag. There's Chips Challenge, which if you saw my video for uh, the top 10 Atari Lynx games, this is my number one game. Um, also, with uh, Chips Challenge, I'll put a link in the description. If you ever do want to just try this out before you, if you don't have the Evercade or if you don't have a way of trying it out, if you have a computer, this game is free on Steam. So I'll put a link in there so you can try that out. There's Todd's Adventure in Slime World, Blue Lightning, which is uh, Atari's version of um, Afterburner by Sega. Very similar kind of style games. There's Zarlar Mercenary, Checkered Flag, which one of my favorite games for the system and also on the top 10 list. Electro Cop, and The Gates of Zendikon. So there's eight games on here. So let me go ahead and bring it back up. And if you look at the screen, it's 4.3 inch screen. It looks really nice to use on here. It'll give you a, some description about the game when it came out in 1989 for Blue Lightning and the genre it is. There's California Games, 89 also. Checkered Flag came out in 1991. There's Chips Challenge, 89. Electric Op, 89. Gates, Suzendicon, Todd's Adventure in Slime World, 1990. Zarla Mercenary, 1990. So let's go ahead and load up a uh, checkered flag. Start with that one. We're going to go to Skull Valley. <laughs> I got a clip from behind. So Skull Valley here is going to be more of a desert theme, kind of a, probably modeled after uh, Death Valley. Oh, the rocket got me. Big stones are undefeated in these games. They always seem to score to win. So that was Checkered Flag. For the Atari Lynx, played on the Evercade. I'm gonna go ahead and go back. We'll go ahead and quit this game. And let's load up Chips Challenge. Chips Challenge. 
Nerdy Chip, McCallahan suddenly stops eating lunch. Melinda, the mental marvel, is sitting down next to him. Melinda smiles. Chip, she says. If you finish the challenge, you can join our computer club, the Bitbusters. Chip has been a distant admirer of Melinda for a long time. Chip crunches his bag of pretzels and gulps. I'll do it. Please enter the code of the starting level or press fire to begin. So basically these are little chips right there, computer chips, and you need to collect them. And after you're done collecting them, go over here. Oh, one more. And there you go. Now they get progressively harder as you go along. If you notice on the side here, it'll tell you how much chips are left that you need to collect in the level. So once you get to zero, then you can exit. Magnet, magnet for force floors, heat, shield for fire, water. So, basically, you're going to go through this game, and there's... I'm trying to remember. Let me see how many levels. Let me see if the manual... This is where the handy dandy manual comes in play. So, let's go ahead and look up Chips Challenge. Chips Challenge. So, it gives you the controls. Veteran Design, I've worked with many of this... Link's popular games, yes, this, the same designer did a lot of these games. So, if you try it out, I think you'll like it. It's a lot of fun to play. I will, as I said, I'm going to put a link in the description here. If you have Steam, or if you don't, it's completely free to get Steam. You can actually get this game 100% for free on your computer. You can play Chips Challenge, see what some of the best that the Lynx has to offer. Uh, I definitely, definitely recommend this game for the Evercade system. And it's just, it's just a fun game overall. But uh, I just want to give you a little quick insight in some of the games on here. I'll be doing more videos on uh, the cartridges that I've just received, including the two links cartridges. But I want to thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. If you need anything at all, have any questions about the Evercade or any of the carts that Evercade offers, send me a message on here or on Twitter at 3DO Gaming, and I'll do my best to help you guys out. But thanks for everything, guys. You take care. Have a great day.